Hi everyone, it's me. I'm back. How are you all doing today? I'm feeling much better today, thank you. I've got a lozenger in my mouth. Hang on, let me um, zoom out a bit. Um, sorry about lozenger, I just had a bit of a froggy throat. So, yeah, I'm back. The, the tooth has left the building. I had it pulled out yesterday. I'm so happy. Well, obviously not happy about losing a tooth. But my voice is a bit groggy because I haven't spoke for two days. Um, and I do apologise if I'm uh, making slurpy noises. So Masterboard Monday is not on Monday. Um, I've been and had my nails done. And I don't know if you can notice. But she did all my nails. And run out of the colour. for the new. You know how this one pinged off. So this one's actually a different colour. To all the others. But I said to her. I'm going to have to live with it. So yeah, so hopefully you should have some more of the, this colour in next time I go. <coughs> but yeah, it could only happen to me, couldn't it? Anyway, I'm not going to do my Master World Monday at the moment. I'm going to pop that on a little bit later on today. This is just a quick quick catch up and just to say I'm back in the land of living. Um, uh, to be honest with you, ladies and gentlemen, it's been the most horrific, probably 10, to 10 days to two weeks of my life with this toothache. And it just overshadowed everything. There's nothing worse than it. And um, I've not been my best. I felt quite emotional yesterday when she pulled the tooth out. And I gave her a big hug and said thank you very much. Which I know probably she was a bit taken back. But dentists, you know, they don't get thanked for their services. They just get, um, uh, people just got to get away from them as quick as they can. So anyway, today I am burning a candle which is uh, Wickford & Co. And it's pink rhubarb and pear and it smells absolutely delicious so having i'll just take it off screen so I'm, what i'm going to do today i'm going to do a quick haul with you the stuff that i bought over the last couple of weeks <coughs> oh excuse my croaky voice goodness me um yeah so a little bit of shopping i've done i got a couple of other bits to come but i'll show you them in and out so um i've got this book which i've had for a while and is this one Cicely Mary Barker a, a flower a flower fair treasury and um I'll have to get rid of this in a minute because I can't really can't really talk um and I absolutely love this book it's beautiful the only thing is that I'm holding it at the moment because the pictures are on the same side so um let me get rid of my lozenger so yeah so you have to choose between the two, which I can't. I find it very difficult to do that. Um, I love the the, the, pay, the pages. I love everything about this book, and I am hoarding it at the moment. So I thought I saw. <coughs> oh, excuse me, on another lady's channel, the postcards. So I I bought these. There are hundred postcards, and they are Flower Fairies, uh, Cicely Cicely Mary Barker. And um, so I, I got the whole lot, 100 postcards. I've got them on Amazon. I think they were, I'm not sure how much they were. Whatever they were, they were worth it. So you get 100 of the pictures. So I'm absolutely bowled over with them. So I should use these in my crafting because obviously you can buy more. The books, are, I think, are a bit harder to come by. So um, absolutely gorgeous. These are, I love them um but as i say i can't go through all of them i'll just grab a few <coughs> just grab a few to sort of like turn them over so you can see they're beautiful oh look at that one there's that one i'm not turning over every one just turning over chunks of the hundred but there's so many beautiful images and then they go from a the alphabet so we've got Apple Blossom, which is A, Bugle, Columbine, I might be saying these wrong, Double Daisy for D, it's Daisy one of my, um, Peonies and Daisies are my favourite flowers of all times, E is for Eyebright, F is for Fuchsia, Gorgeous, um, G is for Gorse, which I did have some Gorse in my garden, but I don't know, it's sort of like disappeared. Herb to tuppence. 
we say we don't say two pence we say tuppence but it is two pence uh iris and then we have jasmine uh, k for carla it's king cup carla and these all these all look like buttercups they're beautiful l lily of the valley probably one of my favorite flowers one and one of my favorite flowers as well m for mallow I don't know what that is. Nasturtium for N. O for Orchis, which I, I'm assuming is like an orchid, but Orchis. P for Pansy, my happy little pansies. I, I've just bought a load of pansies to put in the garden and I call them my happy flowers because they all turn to the sunlight and they're like little happy faces smiling at me when I go out in the garden. I love pansies and they last forever. If you, you pick the dead ones off, they last forever. Queen of the Meadow. And then we've got R for Ragged Robin. S for Strawberry. Look at that strawberry one. Beautiful. T for Thrift. U and V for Vetch. I think they put them together because it's a hard one, isn't it? W for wallflower and then X and Y for yellow dead nettle and then Z for zinnia aren't they beautiful and then we have another set which are this might have be out of them but it tells you on them the estate of zinnia oh no, no that's not it it tells you up here the almond blossom fairy from flower fairies of the trees 1940 and then we've got another array of lots of different ones out of different books. And then there's too many, there's a hundred to go through. But I highly recommend them, ladies and gentlemen. And I'll be doing some crafting with these. Because um, I'm into the, the magic of fairies at the moment. And um, it's no good having that book and just hoarding it and not being able to do anything with it. But I, at the moment I just can't. So there is, um, you can get these on Amazon. Amazon UK, I'm not sure about um, international. Oh, no, I can't get them back in now. They won't go in. Go in. So I absolutely love those. I've been in my misery in my bed, sitting looking through these and making make myself a little bit happier, make me smile. So yeah, so that was the postcards I got. And then um, we when we went to town to get our nails done when I got me me odd nail. Um, I went in the the works. There wasn't a lot in there to be fair, but I did get a pick up a couple of bits. I picked up some jute, which was a pound because I've run out of this. I've been using it in the garden to be fair. That's why I ran out. And then I got some wooden embellishments. What I'm going to use in my cards. I'm just going to paint them or emboss them. They were a pound, and you got one, two. I think it's four. That's probably five. Two, three, one, two, three, four, oh, six. So I've got two packs of those. And then I got, um, in the fairy tradition, some wooden fairies. So I think they're all the same. But I absolutely love them. They're, they go nice in a card, so I don't know. And then I picked up some of this daisy trim for a pound, which I think is absolutely gorgeous. You know what I'm like with pink. Beautiful beautiful and I will be going to the, ra the range um, either later on today because I'm feeling much better today the dentist said just go home rest for the rest of the day which I did um, I licked my wounds and I felt very sorry for myself yesterday and um, I'm, I'm back in the land of living now so and the other thing I got which not that exciting but I quite liked it <coughs> was this pad it's a botanical garden it was four pounds i'll turn it around this way so you can see it but look all the pretties for the garden it's all in greens i love that love that one and this is like looks like a beehive and there's lots more greens uh, green there beautiful flowers yeah so it's really nice really nice quality paper as well four pound you can't go wrong can you love that um I look, to be honest with you i love loads of them i mean look at that that's beautiful and that springtime in itself all these flowers that you can cut out which i will be doing 
which is uh, really nice to have in a paper pad. And then the, I look at that, isn't that beautiful. I don't know if it repeats itself, but I can't see any repeats yet. Yeah, I think it does. So then we have some more flowers to cut out. And then that beautiful picture, that beautiful one again, with the green. Yeah, so it repeats the other side. So in, in actual fact, you could use, you've got one of each. That's what, how it works out for me, is you've got one, one of each pattern because one side you can use and then the, on the other pad you can use the other, on the other piece of it you can use the other side. So yeah, so that's all we've got today. I am going to do my masterboard Monday. I'm going to film that in a minute. I've got to go and get some shopping because we're out, the cupboards are bare. So that was called Botanical Garden. And it was 24 design sheets uh, on 230 GSM and for, it was £4 so that's a bargain price for that. So I'm very happy with that. So that was all my, that's all my spends. I've, um, I've bought a couple of other things which will be coming today so I'll show you them when I do my, if it, they come today when I do my video I'll show you them then. If not I'll show you, I'll, I'll do a film tomorrow. So yeah, so um, thank you everybody for all your well wishes and your comments about my tooth I've got to say it's been an emotional time which sounds ridiculous doesn't it you know I'm a grown-up but my fear is um, not unfounded from my experience as a child um, and it's not something I really want to go into but I had a terrible experience when I was a child as most people do and um, but it's just it's 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 personal to me so anyway I was a brave I was a very brave girl I cried. I cried after the tooth was out. I cried at the dentist. I hugged her and said thank you so much for making it, you know, as least um, a horrible experience as she could. And uh, I'm, I'm very, very grateful that I was lucky enough to get. It just, I just wanted the pain gone. That was all. Even then, when the infection was gone, the pain, the pain was just unbearable. Anyway, enough of me rattling on. Um, I'm going to get my voice back as well and um, I'll be back later on ladies and gentlemen and I'll, I'll drop you down uh, the, the Masterful Monday on a Tuesday again I know I'm terrible and then I've got some other projects coming up so I hope you'll all join me um, if you like my videos please give me a thumbs up and also consider subscribing um, I'm trying to grow my channel and I'd love you to come along for the, the journey and we'll we'll catch up again later so thank you everyone for watching you know i love you all oh and uh, drop me a comment if you want and and uh, don't forget to click the little bell icon and click on to if you want um notifications for every video that goes up i mean they haven't gone up very often but you know you don't want to miss these things anyway thank you everyone and i'll see you all soon folks for another exciting episode Thanks for watching everyone. Bye for now. Bye bye bye.